Oh, right, people. What we're going to do is we're going to try and explore this area. And see if we can make some progress. Now, I know for a fact that there's some minotaurs over here. That's where we died last time. Let's avoid that. I've not done certain things. Like, I've not flipped the switch for the, the thingy. Flip the switch for the thingy, I know, so very informative. Wasn't there an imp? What? Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Save, yes. I don't have to do any of that ever again. I like it. I like it when that happens. I like it when I don't have to repeat myself over and over again off camera. Right, okay, we have made it to a save. And what we don't do is we don't stand in the middle here. I don't also don't know how exactly we're meant to progress through here. Oh, we just run. And now this should be... Oh, no, it's still okay. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, okay. Right, okay, perfect. Quickly going to resave. Okay, let's continue on. Let's see what that's done for us. If anything. I think it's, yeah, it's opened up something over there. I'm gonna try this and hope it works. Nope, it didn't work. I didn't jump, because I'm an idiot. Where am I? Okay, I'm gonna have to avoid this minotaur. That's not too bad. I can, I can take that little detour. So what we unlocked was this. The concentration on my face, did you make, make this jump? Right, well, there's a gold... Oh! Camera issues, again, camera issues. Uh, I couldn't even see that fight, I just had to blindly pray in a combo. Over here we have a chest. With more health potions, I always need health. And the lever, which does something. I'd, it's not always clear what the levers do in this game. But at least I know what that wall is all about now. And we can go and hopefully... See, this is the thing that gets me every time. And I wish I could just... There we go. Now, if I'm right, I should be able to unlock this gate right here. And that's going to take me somewhere new. Okay, let's check out this new area that we've unlocked. Oh. Oh, that was the end of the... Oh, okay. So we missed nine pickups. And we missed one secret area, which was probably the blunderbuss. And I missed a whole... I missed 18 kills. But... What are you going to do? Like, this is a blind through. This is not a perfection playthrough. Oh, so now mechanical golems are a thing. They guard the bridge, and we have to deal with the three alchemists of chaos. And they have missiles and rocket traps and 
a lot of nasty stuff. Why am I on? Oh no, I thought that was 22, it's 72. That's okay. I was like, I just lost like 50 hit. What? Oh, you sneaky little. That's just so annoying. Just lost a whole bunch of health actually, just from a stupid imp. So I got some more blunderbuss shot, but I not help not helpful because I didn't actually pick up the blunderbuss in the last level. That would have been useful, eh? No nah, health potion. At least that's helpful. Right, so three doors, and we're gonna go left first. What? The? Okay, I went left, and then what? I went left and then- okay, just kill me. I went left and then the right door opened and then there was- Stop mooning me and kill me, please. I think they have forks as weapons as well, which is even... more... insulting. So that was weird. I went to go to the left door and the right door opened and then I got stabbed to death by, like, two imps. So we'll try this again. This time we'll be wary of the imp over here. I kind of wish I'd gotten that blunderbuss in the last uh, level now, but oh well, think we've got, we're done with it. We've got to move on. We've got to make it work. This is a blind through, and it's a blind through for a reason. I'm gonna miss things. Right, so let's try going through this door then. Oh, yep, this door works. So it's like a choice. You choose which door and then... If you choose wrong, you get attacked with imps. So that's like a trial and error type thing. And then that opens up this door down here. With even more imps. Let's close the distance because... Imps are at their most deadly, I believe, when they are at range. Oh yeah, we've got two levers and we've got two portcullises. This portcullis, let's try this one first. I heard the sound of... I heard the sound of an enemy spawning. Let's try this one. doesn't appear to be doing anything. Right, let's get in here and deal with whatever's in this room. Oh yes! Oh, so that's a way we can quickly send her if I just parry and then it'll... So if I turn around and then parry, it'll quickly switch me over here. That, that's good to know. Oh, maybe not. I didn't do it that time. But anyway, let's just use a save point. Um, so we're slowly and surely we're figuring this game out and we're getting there. We're making progress. I know it might not be the perfect... The perfect... I know there's other playthroughs of this game on Let's and YouTube from like Kawaii Games and stuff like that and World of Long Plays. And they've all done perfect playthroughs where they've gotten every pickup and every secret and... That's not... That's just not what my channel is about right now. I am not... If I'm doing a... If I'm gonna do... Oh, I should have jumped up there. Now it's too late. Oh no, it's not too late. If I'm gonna do a... A perfectionist playthrough where... I try and pick up every little thing I see and every possible thing. I'll make it clear from the get-go. But um I'm this is this this is not what I'm trying to do for a blind through. The the whole idea of a blind through is that you guys get to see me experience something for the first time. And that includes me missing stuff because I don't know how to get it. I don't know how I don't know what's there. Stuff like that, you know? Right, I'm gonna... Ah, right, okay, made it. Oh, no. Right, 
And there is another lever here. We'll pull this. Does this fix? No, it doesn't. Okay, I don't know what I've done. I have no idea what any of this done. Oh, it turned all these on. I have no idea why I would want to go onto any of these platforms. That's why. That's why you go onto those platforms because those missiles, you need to avoid them. That seems really tricky platforming actually, I'm not gonna lie. Like that does seem like kind of really tricky platforming. The timing seems a bit weird to make it. I should be here, yeah I'm here. But before we go through there, I wonder what, what happens, right? Oh, can I not go back? Am I locked in here now? It looks like I'm locked in the, into this path now. I love that I can swing backwards and kill people that way. That's also a good thing to do. So... So what do these levers do then? Oh. So what does this do over here then? I have no idea what that does. Okay, we're back here. I've done a resave. So now we need to, I need to figure out the timing of this. Ah, not quite. Okay, almost, but not quite. It's really... You could you can just run through it and you can just get this little alcohol, but... Man, just ma making it through this corridor is a little bit mm, difficult. This is probably their infernal missiles and firework rocket traps that these alchemists of chaos have devised. Right, so if I go in this one, right? And then I just run over here. Then run over here. We are good. We've made it. Okay, I'm gonna get the first thing I'm gonna do. Let's try out the Ark of Power. Yes, there is a Minotaur. Well, that didn't do much. Oh no, it killed him. It's fine. Right, so let's test it over here. Let's see what's going on over here. We actually made that through with no damage, I think. Which is pretty cool. Now to not mess this up. And I'm probably gonna mess this up. Chest here. Ah! Game! I didn't even get a lot of good stuff from that. It was like stuff I can't really use. What's that? Can't use it. Okay, so I got a fireball, so that's not really worth it. Maybe if I had a blunderbuss. Maybe that would have been worth it, but I just lost 28 health doing that. Oh, I don't trust that.
I mean, we pulled that lever. Don't know what it's done. It's done something that I don't have a clue what yet. To run across here now, and we need to go check it this way. I'm hoping there's some health potions and not a lot of bad stuff, but it's death trap dungeon. Of course, there's a lot. Of, I hear the. I hear you. Oh, it's the from behind me, you sneaky guys. You're still alive, how? Well, I just lost another drop of another bunch of health. And he's still alive! There's two of them, what? Another bunch of health. Okay, there's something in here. What I could use right now is a health potion of some sort. No, I keep on waiting to f to find the right the right time. Oh, I've got health potion. Why didn't I use that? I keep on waiting to find the right time to use this um, flame lance that we have, but I, I keep on waiting on it. But nothing in this little bit. Just some blood from one of the ants that I killed. Looks like the potions are only instant use when you pick them up in your low health. Like, if you pick one up in your high health, it'll just go into your inventory. Which is kind of nice to know. And there we go, we got some health potions. Thanks, game. Right, so pull this one. And now something should have happened, because that's two levers. Well, whatever has happened, I can't really tell. I can't really tell what has happened, if anything has happened. Because... We've pulled this, right? I don't know, I'm a bit confused with this. I've made good progress though, and I don't want to lose it because of a dumb mistake. Oh, this wasn't here before, that's what it is. Ah, and a save. I love these little things. I, I love these things. These are fantastic to see, and I think this is a good place to end the episode. So we'll end it here. Thanks for being here. We've made some more good progress through the labyrinth, and let's continue on in the next one.